Hi guys, what's going on? It's Clutch coming today with something slightly different to what I normally upload on this channel. Normally, obviously, it's like team-based game mode, nuclears, and like like good KD games and stuff. Today, I'm going to upload a nuked out. So basically, for those who don't know what nuked out is, because I do get asked sometimes when I'm going from... Basically, nuked out is a 30-gun streak in free-for-all. So basically, a nuclear, but in free-for-all, you can't... Obviously, if you get like one kill, then die, you can't get the nukes. You have to go flawless with all gun kills to get it. So we got one on Havoc. Now... The way I played this, the game before the this gameplay, I played a map before this game. This was my second game of the day when I got this new day. The game before, I was on a 26 gun streak on, I think it was Fringe. And basically what happened was, this guy was using Hardwire, Sip, Sense, and Ghost and camping against me. Like, But it was like, he killed me because I pushed into the barn and he was crouched in a corner with Sip, Sense. So, I decided, okay, okay, no. Next game, I'll run Sip Sense. So, this is basically my bitch class. I'm a, it's a Vesper, Fast Max, and Suppressor. And I've got, I think, I think I've got a five pick. I think I've got Ghost, Sip Sense, Hardwire, Scav, and Awareness. I think it is. So, basically, I camp with it. I think it's called Awareness. Amplifier, whatever it's called. I mean, awareness, yeah, Awareness. So, I basically just camped the mid room out to get it. Because I wanted to shit on this kid because he did it to me the game before. So, I wanted to prove a point. And I, this is my question to you guys. This is what I want to actually talk about. Is it more impressive or is it like what's more acceptable in the community? Is it more acceptable to hold areas of maps where there's a lot of kills going on and get a lot of those kills and stay alive than it? Or would you rather run around? I mean, a lot of people say rush, rush, rush is like obviously better or whatever. But if you rush and go 30 and 10, it's not as good as like... Like, not necessarily camping, because camping's, like, just shit. But if you're in mid-map in a room and all the kills are coming from there, you might as well stay there and farm those kills, right? That's how my mindset would work. Anyway, that's what I did in this. This is literally what I did. I helped... Well, to be honest, I was in a shit place. I shouldn't have been where I was. And I, I actually did get quite lucky to get the nuke out the way it happened. Um, luckily, that I got lucky twice, I think, when this, like, kids climbed in the window and I just wasn't actually prepped for it to happen. But I ended up getting away with it, which was quite lucky. Um, when he climbed in, I think there's a, there's a point where he climbs in, and there's a guy coming in behind me as well from the door, and I, I didn't even know what to do. I just panicked and rushed him with the Vesper, and luckily, I got him. If I had been any other gunner than the Vesper, I probably wouldn't have got him both, but what can you do? So, is it better to hold areas and get a lot of kills and stay alive, or, like, that's how I like to play it. Thing is, for example, like I do in this gameplay, I stay in that room and I dominate that room. Um, some would say it's camping, and I would be inclined to somewhat agree I did actually camp that room. However, it made no sense to run away and go to somewhere where there would be less kills in a, in a long run amount of time. So, like, say I can get, like, well, I got 30 kills roughly in that room. So, well, let's say 25 kills in that room in, like, four minutes, which is actually pretty good. But I could have gone to, say, the back end of the map and got 10 kills in five minutes, you know? Like, it, it seems smarter to hold the room where all the traffic was than go somewhere where there's very little traffic. Like, I didn't see the point of that, so I just held it. Um, but a lot of people would say that was a camping move. I would just say it was smart to hold the power point where all the kills were. Uh, but let me know what you think. I'm curious, because some people obviously say camping, and some people would say it's smart to hold. Personally, I play the way I play. You know, I hold, I'll hold a power point and get a lot of kills from it. I really don't understand the point of moving if all the kills are in that area. But that's just me. Anyway, lads, let me know what you think. Thank you for watching. Nuked out. A little bit different. If you enjoyed, make sure you sub, leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about it, boys. And I'll speak to you all soon. Peace out.